All right, so if you click this video, you want to learn how to sound like Ken Carson. And I'm going to show you guys how to do that today. So I decided I wanted to make a Ken Carson preset. And I figured I would just do his most popular song, which is Yale at the time of this recording. So today I'm going to show you guys how to sound exactly like Ken Carson in his song Yale. I just dropped his album X. I haven't even finished listening to it yet because it literally dropped last night. But most of the songs and most of his mixes sound pretty similar to what Yale sounds like. There's nothing like too out of the ordinary that changes. So for the most part, you're getting like an overall Ken mix. And before I lose your interest, if you want to see what the vocal preset sounds like, here's a little preview. And she's smart as fuck, I got this bitch straight out of Yale. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know I'm high as fuck, my eyes is red, but they was your pill. If it's up, then then it's stuck, don't come outside, not in forever. But before we do jump into the video and I break down the preset, I do want to tell you guys that this is available at my website right now. It's called the Ken Carson preset. It's available in pretty much all DAWs. I'm talking about FL Studio, you got a stock and a Waze version. Logic, you get a stock and a Waze version. Then you got Pro Tools and Ableton. Just make sure when you go to the website, you pick the correct version. But that's about enough talking. Let me uh, show you guys how this preset was actually made. Okay, so here's the project right here. And as you can see, it's pretty simple. By the way, uh, a lot of you guys have been asking like the, the colors on the side here and like how everything's organized like this. And and how basically right now this is routed to track one if i drag it down to the verse it goes over to track two which is the verse and it auto does that there's my fl studio mixing template if you want that that's also available on my website it looks like this but that's what i use for like all my mixing so the preset won't actually look like this the preset that you get is just going to be this this mixer track right here which is what we're going to go over right now so i'm going to be showing you guys the waves version but like i said there's always a stock version and i always start with the waves version and then model each additional version off of how I did the Waze version. For example, the stock version, I modeled it completely off the Waze version. So I keep like the same plug in order. But basically what we're doing here is just we're starting out with an auto tune. You guys know what auto tune is. You could use any auto tune you want. So when you get this preset, if you want to replace the auto tune, you could replace it with the free version, FL Studio Pitcher, if you want to. And then next up, we got NS1, which is just, you don't really need this plugin either. It's basically just a noise gate. It's a noise suppressor. And this is my favorite one because it's so easy. It's just one knob and you just mess with this. Basically, all this does is remove any like background noise that would be in the background while you're recording. Also, if you do get this preset, I noticed for the best results, you want to keep your gain really low just because it gives you more of like a cleaner sound. And for me, it just worked a lot better. But anyways, next we go into our first EQ where we kind of shape the vocal. And this is what that looks like. But what I noticed for this song is Ken really has a like nasally sounding mix in this which just works really well for his voice so i'm taking out a lot of that low end kind of leveling it down and then we're pulling up that high end then we have our first compressor and this compressor all i'm kind of doing here is removing any of those transients that really show up in the mix just so we flatten out the vocal and make it sound a lot more even with the beat if you don't know what the ssl channel is it's basically a solid state logic eq board that is a VST, but it was modeled after a real solid state logic board. And the same thing here, we're just removing low end, boosting high end. CLA compressor, this compressor really helps bring volume to your mix. So if I play it with the CLA on, I keep and then with it off. I keep As you can see, we're getting a ton of volume. Now this plugin right here, if you don't have this plugin already, I just don't understand why it's free and it is just one of my favorite plugins. It helps add so much to your mix. Let me play it with it on. So this is what it sounds like with fresh air on. I keep and then here's what it sounds like with it off. I, keep I mean, there's a massive difference. And then this is kind of an uncommon thing, but I always have a de -esser after um, pretty much everything in my mix. And this is actually doing a lot. It's not just taking out the sibilance. It's actually removing a lot of the high end, but it just makes it sound so much more smooth. So I'll play it with. I keep and then without. I keep as you can see, without, it just has a lot of that harsh high end that I don't really want to hear. Then we finish with a fab filter, and, and this is basically a multi-band compressor right here. I have a little bit of compression right here at this low end, and then the, like low mids kind of right here. I'm also compressing a tad bit. I'll show you what it looks like. I keep then we ended the mix just with a fruity chorus, but as you can see, the mix is actually at 10%, so it's just super low amount, but the vocal is so dry. There's literally no reverb. As you can see, it's routed over here to the reverb, but it's at completely zero. And so as dry as the vocal is, I wanted to add like a little bit of something to really make it stand out. And I felt like a chorus just really helped. But yeah, that is literally it. It's one track. There's no ad lib track or anything like that. But if you do want to do some kind of Ken Carson ad libs, I would recommend just duplicating the track over and taking this fruity chorus off. So you would delete this. Actually, we'll just do it with a file, save, mix track, slight as. You just go to a new one. Remove the chorus, 
add a fruity EQ and just make a shape like this. Then I'll show you what that sounds like real quick. Let me put my headset on and turn my mic on. And then you could probably like pan it to the right or left or something like that, or maybe add a little reverb, but I'll show you like a little example of what these ad libs would sound like. Yeah, I keep y'all upstairs. When she wanna fuck, I tell that bitch to ring a bell. Hit her from the back, she can't do nothing but yell. And she smart as fuck, I got this bitch straight out of yell. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know I'm high as fuck, my eyes is red, but they was your pill. If it's up, then man, it's stoked, don't come outside, not in for L. Got a glocky on my hip, and I blow this bitch just like a rail. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, so that's pretty much the end of the video. So the last thing I'm gonna do is just do like a little freestyle at the end. I like to do this with all my presets just to show you guys what it actually sounds like live. I'm gonna click this record button and that's gonna allow me to hear my voice and actually record. So let's do that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thinking this shit sweet till one of their partners disappear. If it's up then yeah, it's stuck. Don't cross my side, not in for ill. And I got all this shit, I think it's weird, but it's so weird. To my side, you gon' get shot right up in your hair And I'ma knock you out like one of these people in the mail Yeah, 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 yeah I'm just in a city, flying around like I'm a whale I don't even know what I just did, I'm not aware I don't think I'm crazy, all these people think I'm scared Yeah, 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 yeah. What's up, then? It's 